you've had over and over again, but it's a different twist. I'll give you it. Here it is. An individual who did not have a mosque in their area, who could not go and offer congregation. They look for a mosque, they could not find one. This year, Allah Azza wa Jal gave them a masjid to pray five times in. However, this person, whenever they go to pray, the moment they stand up to pray, gas is released all the time. And this is not a doubt. This person certainly knows something came out. And this only happens whenever he prays. This, the person, this individual contemplated over it and, real, and realized that Shaitan was trying to make him stop praying. So he tried to fight it by ignoring it. But then it kept on coming and coming and coming. Every time he stood up to pray, something came out, whether silent or loud. So he no once did a lot of things in order to try to counteract this but he wants to fight this so what sh what should he do and how can he fix this this before it goes worse first of all it is mandatory upon men to pray in the masjid now you cannot pray in the masjid unless you have wudu. You're in the state of purity. If this person, whenever he stands to pray in the masjid, passes wind and he knows that this happens only when he's in the masjid, while if he prays home, this doesn't happen, there's something wrong. Usually people can suppress this. And stop it from coming out, especially for these few moments during prayer. Hypothetically, if a person during the first 15 minutes of the time of the prayer, after the adhan, nothing comes out. And when he stands to pray, he st starts to pass wind and he cannot control it. If he goes and perform wudu and come back, the wind still comes out. And if he leaves the masjid, he stops. In this case, he is exempted from praying in the masjid and he should pray home. But as I said, this is not logical or normal. There is something wrong happening here, we, whether it's in his mind, in his subconscious, uh, he's imagining things. He has to do something about it and Allah knows best. 